Da, 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 da. Here we go. We have a meatball update. Um, gosh, these dogs are just really kind of fascinating to look at. They look genetically wrong. <laughs> so, um, Meatball is a, an older dog. Now, he may not be as old as we think um, due to years of just neglectful living in a backyard. But um, the vet thinks he's about seven-ish or so. And these dogs never come without issues. Um, he does have um, a condition called dry eyes, so he will have to be on eye drops uh, for the rest of his life. And he is battling some skin stuff, but that we have seen some improvement with that. And he does have some ear stuff going on, so he's got some ear packing in. But Dr. Amy Jo uh, did uh, have to remove his toe. She clipped his tail back because his tail was um, getting in the way when he used the bathroom. So it was very uncomfortable for him. But um, personality wise, let me tell you what you're getting into with this guy. He just wants to lay around. <laughs> He's about as lazy as they come. Doesn't like to get up and move much. Probably my guess is because it's uncomfortable because of the way their belt look. <laughs> But he is so sweet, he gets along with everybody, and really just kind of wants to hang around. Right, Meatball? Look at that face. You a good boy? And we have noticed a couple of, you know, things that might be a little bit, you know, strange. Like, the, when I had him at the rescue one time, he just kind of stood in the corner and barked at nothing. <laughs> But then he just went and laid down. You know, he's a very easy going guy. So if you adopt Meatball, just know that he is older and he comes um, with some years uh, of neglect behind him and more than likely will have some future problems with health. We've gotten the, the basic ones under control though. Look at that. <laughs> Trust me, when I turn off this camera, I'm gonna smooch him. <laughs> So there's the meatball update. Right, meatball? <laughs>